Top end crooks are brilliant liars. I've been a crime writer in Melbourne since 1979. You search for the truth and sometimes fail. It's really difficult at times to find it because there's so many different versions of the same event. So you try first off to deal with things forensically. And then when you finish your story, you look and go, well, do I believe it? And if you don't, you go back to, to stage one. I've had good police tell me and given me the, the sort of background evidence that such and such has committed a murder. And so for 15 years, I've believed a certain person has done it, only to find DNA has cleared them. So you learn nobody has a monopoly on the truth. Many of the people that we write about are so innately interesting. They are often like characters out of a television series. I go to sort of media schools or journalism schools and I see two, three hundred young, really intelligent people with their eyes on fire looking and going, I'd do anything to have your job. So how lucky am I?